Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Liz of Chicago Law Luxury Makeup. For today's video, we are doing a haul video. It's been a really long time since I have done a haul video. And recently, I have picked up quite a few new releases and some new to me makeup. So I want to kind of go through everything that I have picked up, show you guys the new stuff that I have and what's going to be coming on my channel very soon. I have a lot, you guys. I have a lot of Dior. I have a lot of Chanel. I have a lot of Sicily. It's a lot. I have a lot, a lot, a lot. We're going to go ahead and we're going to start with Dior. Now, as many of you know, I cannot order from the Dior website itself, Dior.com. I used to be able to, and for whatever reason, my account was suspended. I have called Dior customer service. I have tried to find out what I can do to get my account not suspended anymore. Their solution to me was shop at Sephora, shop at Bloomingdale's. I kid you not. They told me to shop at other retailers. A lot of the Dior products that come out are exclusive to Dior.com. So there are some products that I really, really wanted to try that I wasn't able to. So for years, I have not been able to order directly from Dior. I have tried everything, everything. I have created new accounts, new email address, used my husband's email address. I mean, used a different shipping address. I have tried every single way that I could think of, but I finally, finally found a way to order from Dior. And you guys, <laughs> I went a little crazy. I went a lot crazy. I ordered so much Dior. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to open it. If you struggle like me and can't order from Dior, let me tell you what I did. I created an account in my son's name. I used a completely separate email address and I used his part, his bank information to order it. And that seemed to work. I have tested it where I can log in on my phone with his account, place an order using my debit card. So that seems to work and I've able to place multiple orders because I did try it multiple times. Fingers crossed, it continues to work because Dior has an amazing, amazing rewards program and I have watched as people get these amazing Dior gifts and I'm just over here waiting for mine because I can't order. I can't order, but I finally have ordered. So we're, we're gonna go ahead and open my Dior orders first. So the first order I placed was for eyeshadows and blushes and I completely, completely forgot to check out with like the gift box. So it all just came in a big box. It really wasn't that pretty. These were my gifts with purchase. So I will show you guys those, but first I wanna get into these eyeshadows and blushes. The first thing I picked up is a limited edition blush. And this is shade number 621, Splendid Rose. I believe this is the holiday blush. It looks beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I cannot wait to use it. Um, I'm really excited to create several Dior videos for you guys. Here is a Dior eyeshadow. And this is the holiday one. This is number 543, Promenade Dory. So I'm definitely gonna be using this Dior holiday eyeshadow and blush to create some Dior looks for you. And next is a, another limited edition Dior eyeshadow. This is the eyeshadow. I think it looks beautiful. So this is shade number 523 beige couture. I mean, this color story looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I cannot wait to use it. And another eyeshadow palette that is exclusive to Dior. So this is a permanent eyeshadow, but one that is only sold on Dior.com. And that is the shade Grand Ball. And that's what that looks like. It's a beautiful, neutral, everyday color story, which is exactly what I love. And I thought that I would really, really like this color story. The last is a blush. And this is another limited edition blush. And that's what that looks like. So this is Grand Ball, but with the different pattern on it, it is limited edition. So that was my first order. That was me kind of just testing to see what happened. And like I said, I was so excited that I was gonna be able to order. I completely forgot to do anything with like a gift box. But I did get, like I said, a couple of gifts with purchase. This cute little bag, which I think will be really, really good for traveling. But I got a sample here of the Dior Attic Lip Maximizer, which I do love, love, love the lip maximizers. And then this cute little Dior bag with some samples. Dior Serum. This looks like a huge sample. 
Oh yeah, that's that's a really good size. Dior lipstick. This is shade 100 Nude Look, which is a beautiful nude. The Miss Dior perfume. I'm actually going to give this to my stepdaughters because I know that they really like it. A little sample of the lotion. Then we went ahead and we ordered some more. And of course I remembered to get the gift box because I do really think the Dior packaging is gorgeous. So in this order, I picked up the candle. As soon as I took that cellophane wrapper off, I can smell it. It smells so good. So it's the scent of Blooming Bouquet, which is the Dior fragrance that I love. It smells so good. Oh my God. You guys, this is so beautiful. It is so, so beautiful. It's tiny though. It's very, very tiny, which I was expecting. It smells really good, but it is very, very pretty. I'm just gonna let that sit out right here and I can smell it because it smells so good. All right, and then of course I placed another order. I couldn't stop. I couldn't stop. I mean, I couldn't. Once I had the privilege to order from Dior, I just couldn't stop myself. So here is how this one comes packaged. I did get this. They had like a promo code that you could use. And this is what I got. So I have a little sample here of the 999 lipstick, which is red. So I'm not going to open it. Um, I'm definitely going to be gifting this to someone else because I will not wear red. Occasionally I will wear red, but red's not normally my color. A little deluxe sample here of their nail polish. I have never tried the Dior nail polish, so I'm really excited to try that. And then this cute luggage tag. So I'm definitely going to be using this in my upcoming travels. This is going to be on my bag. I thought it was really, really cute. If I can remember what the promo code was, I will put it down in the description box so that if it is still available, um, you guys can pick up this cute little set as well. It was free. I think I had to spend $150, but this little set was free. In this order, I picked up another blush. I do believe this is, it does say it's limited edition. And this one comes in the felt packaging, which the others did not. And then there's what that looks like. Looks like a perfect Liz shade, although I do think it looks very similar to all the other blushes that I just picked up. Clearly have a type. I also picked up a luminizer. So here's the luminizer. It is limited edition and it is shade number two, Coral. I love the embossing on it. I thought it was really, really pretty and I do really like the Dior luminizers. Then I picked up one of the new Dior Addict lip cases. This came out for holiday. And then I picked up a Dior Attic refill. I do already have this one though. After I placed my order, I checked the shades that I have and I do already have it. So this is shade number 100 nude look, which I do already have. So I think I might reach out to Dior, see if I can exchange it for a different shade. So that is everything I picked up at Dior.com. Now I did pick up some more Dior. I'm telling you guys, this haul is large. I just picked up a few things at Ulta had a sale so this order i picked up quite a while ago but they had a sale they also had a dior gift with purchase so i went ahead and picked up a few dior products the things i picked up was another dior lip attic case in the blooming bouquet pattern which was really really beautiful but then i did also pick up another dior blush and this is shade number 339 so there is 339 again i think all these blushes look the same we are definitely going to have to do some swatches of all of these blushes and see how similar they are. I probably didn't need all of them. I also picked up a Dior lip oil. I have never tried the Dior lip oils. I mean, I've swatched them in store, so I've felt them, but I've never owned one. The shade I got is shade number one, pink. So it actually looks pretty clear to me. But I am excited to try the lip oils if i like them i will probably pick up some of the deeper shades during the sephora sale and then with my dior purchase i did like i said get a dior gift for purchase and i got this cute red little bag the material is very very soft and then i got a sample of the dior show mascara as well as a sample of the J'adore perfume. And I think that this is the new one. It smells really, really good. So I'm really happy to have that. So that is all my new Dior. 
I got a lot, you guys. I really, really did. I am definitely going to be doing a full face of Dior using a bunch of this new makeup. Now, I don't know if this video will go up before or after that Dior video, but I'm definitely going to be using some Dior very, very soon. Now, like I said, when I placed this Ulta order, they were having a sale. I was able to save a little bit. So I did pick up a few other products and I feel like I may have already talked about some of them. I don't know, but the ones that I haven't used and are still waiting here for me to use is I picked up a new Chanel eyeshadow quad. This is part of their per collection. And I picked up shade number 266 Tesse Essential. So it does come packaged like all the other Chanel eyeshadows. And then that's what that looks like. I thought it looked really, really pretty. I do like to buy permanent items because I'm constantly getting the new and the limited edition. And then I feel like you can't ever get those again. And so I hate using them. So I was very excited to finally pick up something from their permanent collection. And this was a shade that I've been wanting for a while. I saw that Ulta had it and I went ahead and picked it up. And then I also picked up the La Base Mascara. This is a repurchase for me. I have used multiple of these. When I placed my order, I purchased some hair pills from Way that I have been using and so far really been impressed with. And it was during their hair, like their hair sale. And so I was able to get this huge bag um, completely free as a gift with purchase. There are so many hair samples in here. I I don't even, there's no way I could ever possibly use them. So I'm definitely going to be putting some aside for a giveaway. I'm definitely going to be giving some to my stepdaughters. But this is completely full of hair samples. So I thought that was a really nice gift with purchase. Now I did pick up another one of the Hermes quads. This is shade number two. And this is the green eyeshadows. Again, it comes in the standard orange box. Again, it comes with a dust cover and a little pouch. And then here is the green quad. I think it's beautiful. This teal, a little bit outside my comfort zone, but we're going to try it. I am definitely going to be using this very shortly to create a look using the green because I think it looks like it's going to be beautiful. I did pick mine up at Saks, but I do know that they are at multiple retailers now. Next, we have Chanel. So I did order this from the boutique and then I ordered this from online. So we're going to go ahead, open this, and I will show you guys what I picked up from Chanel. So I picked up the oversized illuminating face powders. So I picked up warm gold, pearly white, and I had told her that I wanted the other shade. She forgot to include it, which is why I placed another order online at chanel.com. I did also pick up the Rouge Allure X-ray. I wasn't going to, but then I saw how beautiful it looked and I just couldn't resist. So I did pick that up as well. And this is in the limited edition shade 812 Beige Brut. So that's what that looks like. So online, like I said, I did pick up the other shade, which is Precious Coral. I will go ahead, unbox all of these and show you which designs I picked up. So in Precious Coral, this is the design that I picked up. Now I was surprised that Chanel came out with so many different designs. I can understand the different shades. I couldn't understand all of the different designs. There is Pearly White. And these are very, very large, very, very large. There is no way that I will ever, ever finish these. And then here is the design for warm gold. So I'm really, really excited to swatch these and to apply them on the face. I really cannot wait to see how they work. All right, just a few more stores left. I still have a lot, you guys. I still have a lot. Um, next up is Bergdorf's. So Bergdorf's had their rewarding beauty event. And depending on the amount of money you spent, the greater your percentage was. So go big or go home, right? So I ended up placing a very large order with Bergdorf's. It came in multiple shipments and I still don't even have everything. I'm going to open up this one first, this box. And I picked up the Baccarat Rouge 540 candle. Now this is a repurchase. I've already gone through 
several of these candles. I absolutely love them. I've been giving them away as gifts. Who wouldn't love to get a Baccarat Rouge 540 candle? I do want to open it because I have them broken in the past. So this one did not. Wow. Oh, it looks so pretty. Mm, and it smells so good. So, so good. So Baccarat Rouge 540 is one of my all-time favorite favorite perfumes. So this candle is very much loved. Now I have used several of the products that I've already purchased. So I'm just going to be showing you the ones that are still boxed up waiting for me to use and show you guys. I did pick up another one of the Guerlain Terracotta Foundations. This is my winter shade. I love this foundation. It is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So I went ahead and picked up my winter shade while I could get such a good discount. I picked up the Clé de Peau, the Concentrated Brightening Serum. This is hands down my favorite serum. I love it. So across all brands, all serums, this Clé de Peau serum is my favorite. Now I only use it during the day. I have other serums that I use for nighttime, but this is my favorite daytime serum. And I also did pick up additional Clé de Peau products during the sale, some of which I've already used. And one thing that I did pick up was a lip liner. Now I thought I would be able to use this without the case. I can't. So I will have to go back and buy the case, but I did pick up a lip liner and I picked up shade number one. I also picked up the Chantecaille holiday collection. So I picked up the lip gloss, I picked up the eyeshadow, and I picked up one of the powder face products. So I picked up the Radiant Glow Blur Powder. So I did pick up all of these. I already have the lipstick. I will definitely be using these products soon to show you guys the full Chantecaille Holiday Collection and how it applies. But I will go ahead and open it just to show you. The packaging is beautiful. It really, really is. It's the first time that I've opened it and it's so pretty. So this is a Radiant Blur Powder. It's got like a little pink to it. And then here is the eyeshadow, same packaging. And then that's what that looks like. That is what the lip gloss looks like. It looks really, really pretty. I have to swatch it, you guys. I have to. Not much color to it, which I did not expect, but I think it's going to look beautiful, beautiful on the lips. And then the last thing that I picked up from the sale that I haven't showed is I picked up another Labouche Rouge eyeshadow that is completely, completely broken. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay. I'm definitely going to call them. Yeah, that's bad. Okay, I'm just going to set that to the side and I will reach out to Bergdorf's. Now, I did pick up from Hourglass two of the new palettes. So one of them I did switch out the outer packaging. So here is this one. Now, these do have some re-promoted shades. Yes, I should just come to expect that with Hourglass. But I do love, love, love the Hourglass formula. So even if there are shades I already have, I will still use them. So here is the jellyfish. And those are those shades. I pick these palettes up every year. Every year. And I just love them. I absolutely love them. I cannot wait to swatch these and try these and play around with them. All right. And last but not least is my Sisley order. And I was not paying attention when I ordered and I forgot to tell them that I wanted a gift box because again, Cecily also has a beautiful, beautiful packaging, but instead of the beautiful packaging, <laughs> I just got everything thrown in a box. So I did pick up a backup of the paddle brush. I said I was going to, and I did. So that is what it looks like. It's my favorite, favorite brush. And so I did pick up a backup. Picked up the conditioner and I did pick up the jumbo. I figured I have the jumbo of the shampoo and I might as well get the jumbo of the conditioner. So I do have the conditioner and it does come with a pump. I talked about this in my Sisley video. This is the brand new Supremia Supreme Anti-Aging Skin Care Lotion. I cannot wait to have this and use this. This will be my new nighttime lotion. I have used samples of it. It's really, really good. And I'm really excited to open up the full size. Also talked about this in my Cicely recommendation video. I said I was going to pick it up and I did. This is the full size of the Black Rose Beautifying Emulsion Satin Veil. So this is the Black Rose Body Cream. It is so, so good. 
So that's what that looks like. Oh, I'm so excited. So that's everything that I purchased. And then as a free gift, I did get a full size of the neck cream. And then these bags are full of samples. The eyeshadow, I forgot. So I picked up shade number 15. This is a matte and it's a taupe shade. So that's what that looks like. I said I got a bunch of samples. I'm not going to go through all the samples because I think there is a lot. But that is everything that I have picked up recently. I did place one more order and that is from Dior again. I went ahead and picked up the second blush and eyeshadow for their holiday collection. I'll be here next week. I also picked up one of the Chanel little holiday gift sets. I picked up the skincare one so that should be here next week as well. I didn't want to wait on those. I wanted to get this video up for you guys so I could start using these new products and getting some new videos up for you. Let me know down below what you guys are most interested in seeing and I will make sure I get those videos up for you. I want to thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope everyone is staying safe and healthy. I will see you in my next video.